adding three place numbers. How many hundreds, tens, and ones are in each number? Well, the number that we have, 856, can also be represented as 800 plus 50 plus 6. And when we add the three numbers, of course, we have our 6, our 5, and our 8, 856. So we can see that this represents what is indicated here. We have 8 100s, 5 10s, and 6 1s. One store donated 562 loaves of bread for the needy, and another donated 235 loaves. How many loaves of bread were donated from both stores? Again, when we read the problem, it's really important that we read for understanding. We want to make sense of what's being asked here. How many loaves of bread were donated from both stores? In most cases, the question in the problem is in the last sentence, and we can identify it here. How many loaves of bread were donated from both stores? So that indicates to us that we're adding. The next thing to do is to locate or, or, or find the numbers in the problem. And we see we have 562 and 235. Those are the numbers of interest to us. Those are the numbers that will give us our solution. So let's indicate we want to write the numbers neatly and carefully, 562, 235. Also, it's very important that we align the numbers correctly. We put, we put the ones in the ones column, the tens in the tens column, or the middle column, and the hundreds in the hundreds column, or to the far left. Now all we need to do is just add. 5 plus 2 is 7. 3 plus 6 is 9. 2 plus 5 is 7. So we can see our solution is 797. Now let's see if it makes sense. How many loaves of bread were donated from both stores? That number would be 797. Always ask yourself, what does this number represent? What does it mean? A plumber needs 234 feet of this PVC pipe for one building, and he needs 123 feet of this PVC pipe for another building. How many total feet of PVC pipe does he need to buy? Now let's do the math. We have to add these two numbers, 234 feet plus 123 feet. 234 plus 123. 3 plus 4 is 7. 2 plus 3 is 5. 1 plus 2 is 3. So what they need for the two buildings is 357 feet of PVC pipe. Let's look at another problem. This is a cattle yard for an auction that took place in Texas. These are young heifers that are from four to six months old. The ranchers sell them and buyers come and bid on these cattle. Then the cattle are taken to feedlots. When they reach about 1,300 to 1,400 pounds, they are then sold to the meat market. As you can see, these cattle are not very happy being in this yard. This is now inside the auction where buyers are bidding on the cattle. See if you can understand the auctioneer. I can't. And these are the buyers bidding on the cattle. Let's look at this problem. Jim helped his uncle on the ranch. His uncle gave him two head of cattle for his work. One weighed 415 pounds and the other one weighed 384 pounds. How much did these two cattle weigh? So we find in the problem 415 and 384 pounds. Now we have to combine these two numbers together. 415 plus 384. 5 plus 4 is 9. 1 plus 8 is 9. 4 plus 3 is 7. 
So both head of cattle weighed 799 pounds. Please pause the video now and complete the problems in your workbook. When finished, press play and we'll continue with the next lesson.